Intimacy is often perceived to include a license to abuse. The abuser treats his nearest, dearest and closest as mere objects, instruments of gratification, utilities or extensions of himself. They are but functions. He feels that he owns his spouse, girlfriend, lovers, children, parents, siblings or colleagues. As the owner, he has the right to damage the goods or even dispose of them altogether. Hence, the abuse. Most abusers are scared of real intimacy and deep commitment. They lead a pretend, confabulated life. Their love and relationships are gaudy, fake imitations. The abuser seeks to put a distance between himself and those who truly love him. Those who cherish and value him as a human being, who enjoy his company, and who strive to establish a long-term, meaningful relationship with him. Those, in other words, who threaten him.